Well, for anyone who uses Facebook on your smartphone, in the next few days, you're going to have to download Facebook Messenger to chat with your friends. But before you hit download, take a look at the terms of service. 47 ABC's Jennifer Fulgeniti spoke to one local expert who calls the wording inside creepy. The Facebook Messenger app may make chatting with your friends a little easier, but wording in the terms of agreement has many worried. It's terrible. It definitely concerns me. Facebook says the app will soon be mandatory for anyone who wants to message their friends from a smartphone. Hitting accept gives the app permission to make calls from your phone, record audio, use your camera, and access your call history at any time without you even knowing. I have a lot of private stuff on my phone that I don't want leaked out. But technology expert Travis Fisher says it's hard to tell if the company's intentions are bad. There are a lot of ways that you could interpret the, the words to mean that it's going to create a better user experience for you. Um, but when you look at the literal meaning of the words, then it becomes uh, creepy. While they tend to be long, Fisher says those terms need to be read. To save time, he says you can usually skip the beginning, typically just a background on the company. Buried inside the, the middle of that document, you're going to find you know, what the application wants to do. What people decide to do with this new information came up 50-50. You're probably going to go ahead and just continue to use it and take that risk. Uh, knowing that, I probably should close the, the app. I just guess I'm just going to give up the social media for good. Jennifer Fulgeniti, 47 ABC. All right, well, one bright side for Apple users, you will be prompted to approve the app's use of your microphone and camera the first time it tries to. But for all you Android users, once you hit accept, the app has full range.